up YouTube, it's your boy Burner. I'm about to drop some prison stories, so let's go ahead and talk about uh, prison life in Utah. I just recently watched a video that Death, Death from uh, 23 and One Lockdown released, and shout out to Death. I've been trying to get on his channel for a while. He's reached out to me. We're about to have something in the mix, but I just want to kind of get the air cleared and everything figured out because I think a lot of people sleep on Utah. I really do. And I don't understand why a lot of people just don't respect us for who we who we are, man. Like, shit gets crazy there. He talked about a murder that happened in one of his videos. Well, guess what, guys? I was in the housing unit when it happened. That happened in Section 2. I was in Section 3. I literally watched the entire situation go on, you know? And there's a lot of things I can't really talk about. Like, you know, I don't want to sit here and talk about their case because I don't know if... I heard old boy got L whopped, which is life without parole. Okay, so much love to young cuz man. He's a good dude. Um, with the whole beef on Ogden Thresse, like I've heard Death say a lot of things. Um, Death, I love you, dog. I really do. But that was a bad picture. Those five dudes in that picture, it, that was just a bad look for that hood, bro. Don't get shit twisted, dog. Like. Ogden, Ogden Threses are an actual gang here, and they do fucking put in work, and they are about their shit. Same with the Crips. They do their things. They're about their game, too, homie. Like, I'm just saying, I, I want to get I wanna get shit twisted, dog, because at the end of the day, bro, everything's, there, there's gangsters anywhere, homie. And like I said, death, much love, dog. You're, you're a beast. I just felt like I had to shine some uh, light up on this because I am from Utah, and I've been involved in prison life in Utah, and it's not a joke, bro. No matter where you go, there's going to be killers, dog. And there's going to be people that are about their shit. And I'm telling you right now, I've met some solid, very, very, very solid individuals when it came to this, okay? When it came to the gang life and when it came to being inside the prison and meeting killers and people that are there on crazy charges, I've been there, done that. A lot of people, you wouldn't, you wouldn't even think that they were in there for what they were in there. Like, I met some old dude. He was in there for killing, like, three people, bro. And I would never would have suspected that this old 60-year-old man is a triple homicide fucking... That's what he's in there on, you know? And it's just crazy, man. Like I said, don't, don't judge a book by its cover. There are a lot of Mormons out here. There are. But you know what? When it gets dark, dog, shit happens. There was just a shooting by my house not too long ago. This dude got hit, and his car got hit, and I'm just saying, man, like, it's just crazy. Life is real out here. Utah is not a joke. The big gangs out here are the Ogden Threses. They're out here in Ogden, okay? Um, there's a lot of Serenos. There's a lot of, uh, there's a few Nortes. There's, there's some Bloods. Like, it's active, bro. It's active. It really is. And uh, people lose their lives out here. I've seen a lot of, I've seen a couple, two, three people I grew up with lose their life out here. And it's just sad, man. It's sad that they couldn't have just picked a better path. Gang banging don't get you nowhere. It will never get you nowhere. Death, I do agree upon you. The only place it will get you is either in prison or dead, dog. And at the end of the day, that's just facts. And anybody that's involved in that life that watched my YouTubes, that believes in me, that knows that I push legitimate content and I'm just trying to come from the bottom of my heart to express to you guys through my platform, that that's not the way to go. Because even though it is active out here and there is a lot of shit that goes down, there's a lot of people that die and lose their lives. Um, it's nothing to be proud about. It's not, it's not a good scene to be in. And that's what I just got to say about it. Much love.